Good morning, wherever you are in the world. It is a beautiful day here in western Belize. The sun is shining, the trees are blowing, and I just woke up in a real good mood, so I hope you guys are too. Today I'm going to explore a little bit on foot. I believe there's some Mayan ruins, like 100 meters from me. Then I'll go back into town and try to find something new to discover or a unique individual to communicate with, to have a conversation with. Let's start our day off with some ancient ruins. You're Chris, right? I'm Chris. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty neat. Yeah. And now I'm here. Yes, Where am I? This is Kahal Pitch. This is a Maya ruin. Okay. And in here there is a museum. Yeah. And at the back is the site. The ruin? Okay. Yeah. Where, how much do I pay? It's a $10 fee. 10 Okay. okay. There's 10. Here we have it. I'm doing the tourist type thing. Here we go. It doesn't say that I cannot climb it, so let's climb it. wonder what that was used for. Some big steps. Look, goes up to my knee. Work those calves. I feel like the king of the castle. You can see the sweat. Kick back and enjoy the moment. I'll be back. Now, I appreciate ancient ruins. Archaeology, love it. Love reading about it, watching documentaries about it. But I know very little about the location that I'm at right now because I didn't do any research, which is 100% my fault. So I can't teach you too much. Now, this does not look too ancient to me. This looks very new. I'm guessing they put this in to hold everything up. This looks new as well. So I have to do a little research to find out. This says Plaza A slash A. But I'm curious to know what this was used for. Almost like a mini coliseum type. Maybe event venue. Maybe for religion. I don't know. I'm sure I sound ridiculous because I haven't the faintest idea. But that's it. It's time for me to walk around. i got to get in the city. I'm hungry. My stomach is talking to me. So let the adventure continue in the city. It's a nice hot day. Yeah, very nice. Where, where you want to go, sir? I guess to the bus station. Bus stop? Would you have any idea what time buses come or no every, idea? Every hour. Okay. On the hour? Uh, sometimes on the hour, sometimes not. <laughs> Today feels hotter than other days, I don't know. Yes. It feels very humid today. It's a little, well, when it's it humid like that, it's going to be very warm. Yeah? Yeah. Very, 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 very warm. And you're in pants. For you, the heat is normal. For yeah. me, it's... It's too hot. No, it's not too hot. I love it. Uh, okay, okay. I don't like the cold. You like the cold? No, I don't like the cold. Oh, you yeah. don't like... Oh, no. okay, okay. I like the heat. So you're going back to Belize No, I'm going to go... Dangria. Okay. How do you say it? Dangria. 
Dangria. So I gotta find a bus. What you do when you reach Belmopan? Yeah. You gotta change bus, right? Yeah. So, you so I can take any bus to Belmopan. Yeah, right from here. Yes. When you reach Dangriga. Yes. I mean to Belmopan, then you change bus to a different bus. To Bel to yes to Belmopan. You the, see the market. Is there different quality buses? Well, we have. Because I took the school bus yesterday. Uh huh. And it was like I could, couldn't move. Couldn't, yeah, People were okay. hugging oh, over okay. me and yeah, holding, yeah, and it was yeah. so hot. Okay, that is a regular bus. Yeah. So there's something different as well. As we have the express. Okay. Okay. Would you have any idea how often that comes? That will be, I guess, every time is nine, nine. That will be maybe about ten. We should we, we should have another one. Okay. Yeah. It will not express on the windshield. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Reach Belmopan, you see another bus with about Dangriga, yes, Placencia, or you will see another one that marks Dangriga, Punta Gorda. And it's worth making the trip down there. Yo, Everyone's yes. saying culturally that's the place yes, to be. That's the culture capital. Okay, yes. I think it's very important for me to explore the culture. Yes. Like today, Friday, you see you will see a lot of action. Okay, a lot of action. Like, what is action? Like, you see a lot of people playing drums, girls yes. playing drums. Punta. Yeah, Punta. That's right. That's yeah. right. And see, you, you brought a smile to my face. Yes, and then you see they will be under the shed playing dominoes. That's the most thing that, that okay. you see. Then you will see them in, the, in their Garifuna attire. Yes. You know? I'm very curious. Yes. I like going to a place with no research. I don't Google it, I don't want to look at it, I want to experience it firsthand, yeah. right? Okay. So, yeah, I'm very, very curious. Yeah. It's like Christmas. Yeah. I want to open the present yes. and see what's inside. Yeah. That's right on the main street in Tanguga. You will hear the drums playing. You can just walk in there, take your photos, ah. dance in front of you. I'm ready to yeah. dance. Yeah. Everything. One or two tequila and I'm dancing. <laughs> dance too. <laughs> Maybe I'll never leave. Uh, well, I'm going to be wearing a tire uh, and uh, you know. the, the typical attire and I'm That's there right. for good. I love Belize. It's been incredible. incredible. I've been here over two weeks now. Okay, okay. Wandering around the country. Wandering around the country. That's very good. This morning I was going to go back to Belize City, uh -huh. and something told me I need to go head south. Head south. Okay. So I, I changed my mind like that. Yeah. Okay. And I said, okay, it's time to go south. It's time to go south. Okay, okay. That's good. No agenda, no uh, yeah. itinerary. Yeah, just, right. just blow with the wind. Blow it, blow it up. Blow it up. Yeah, okay. I like that. The city is nice. It's very, very small, but it's nice. Yeah, the bus will come right here. Yeah, this is where I got yeah, off. Then I'll go around. And where do you buy a ticket? No ticket. Just jump oh, on the you bus. get on, okay. Yeah, jump on the bus and you're good to go. Hey, the Mayan ruins were great. The people here in San Ignacio, spectacular, loved it. But I'm an adventurer, I need to continue. Something is drawing me or pulling me south. It's like the center of culture. Thank you. Yes, my friend, I'll have. You want to support the locals right here? Yes. Hey. They're good though? Yes, man. God bless you, man. Let me have, let me see what it looks like. You see the business right here? Come look, my little business, man. Take a look, take a look. Okay, give me, give me two. Okay, no problem. Please. Where you from? Canada. Oh, wow. It's far, man. Yeah? I feel right at home here. Oh, thank you. You feel safe? Feel safe. I'm hungry. Give me three here. Okay, no problem. I got five. No problem. Maybe it's four fifteen three. Yeah. Eh? The rest is for you. God bless you, man. Give it a shot. Wow, really hot. 
you wouldn't think a man walking around with a cooler to keep the meat pie this hot, but it's good. Very good. This is the bridge that I crossed earlier. This bridge is not for the faint of heart. Now, I've said before that I'm, I'm frightened of heights, uh, but I've always lived in condos, so balconies don't, don't phase me, but if you look down, not only are there holes there, there's holes, 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 holy hole, hole. Yes, sir. So, crossing the bridge. Still hunting for my crocodile, but no luck. Okay, I'm reaching my first destination, first stop where I'll get off and look for a new bus here in Belmopan. Yes. Good, man. Everything good. Yes, I'm very good. Thank you. I appreciate that. Would you know where I get a ticket for Dangria? Ticket for Dangria. Tell me. All right. Thank you. Right in the corner there. All right. Thanks. So the bus is here, but it's full. So I'm gonna have to wait. Wait for the next one. Oh. Hello, to Dangria. Hello? I'm right, so can I buy a ticket now? No. Are there any other buses? It's just one bus. There's no express buses? Okay, thank you. Well, I'm here, but can't get a ticket just yet. So I have about 45 minutes till the bus comes, so I'll wander around a little bit, explore. I like your work, man. I appreciate it. I like your shoes and your matching your shirt. Thank, Thank you. you, sir. Give me a little bit of this money, man, please. Want to come? Yeah. Good? He didn't have much confidence. I don't know. You got to check up on him. Uh, I don't, you got you? <laughs> yeah, I'm on. All right, man. Good. I appreciate the love. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. So I just paid somebody, uh, one of the stalls that are selling food, I just paid them like 10 Belizean, 5 US dollars. I said, if you could hold my suitcase and bag for an hour, 
so I can walk around without worrying about carrying stuff with me. I'm excited, it's Friday, it's Friday, so by the time I get down to my final destination, there should be like parties in the streets and, and such, so I'm excited. The weekend is almost here. There's really not much for me to film in this area, so I'm going to go back to the station and wait the 30 minutes for my bus to arrive so I can be heading in the direction of my final destination. There goes my bus. Um, on the side of a highway, hopefully I can find a taxi. I didn't want to have to make the full 25 minute drive. When I GPS it, my hotel is like two or three kilometers from here. So either I taxi, I walk, or I get checked. We're in the citrus capital. door to door to my destination. Well, I can have a party here tonight. I'm just joking, no parties. What about, uh, have you ever seen a Jaguar before? Uh, around here, no, they don't come around. No? No, so uh, this is the Wi-Fi password, so if you need to connect, connect to the other Wi-Fi, yes. we are probably going to catch another extension, but all of them are the same password. Wonderful. Yeah, so that's the Wi-Fi password. Okay, you've been a great help. Thank yeah, you so much. There's a room um, near AC and everything. Wonderful. And there's a key here. And you're just going to grab me some water. Yeah. Wonderful. Thanks. No so, it's my room for the next night or two. Quick look around. I'm at David Falls Inn. Clean, smells good. Internet seems good. So, it's all I really need. I'm gonna take a quick peek up at the roof. Just relaxing for a good hour or so. Then I'll go into the city. The reason I'm here, it's Friday night. Heard there's gonna be a lot of culture, drum playing, punta dancing, badman. I feel like I'm in a big party. Big party. I feel like I'm in the top of a tree house. There's the kitty cat.
And you said you grew up in this last village, so you, you grew up yeah, in the I'm area. Yeah, I'm from here. Right. I'm from here. So this is my area. So I so, know it a lot. So, yeah, give me an idea. On a Friday night like today, what, what do locals normally do? So locals do? would go, let's say, um, on Fridays, a lot of locals would like, go out and drink like, to the, a lot of places. What are they drinking? Badman? Badman, anything. <laughs> you drink Badman? No, I drink uh, it was Belizean beer, Belikin beer. Okay. The Lanshar. Uh, yeah, so this is a, it's more like people you know, in the street are calling me Badman because that's bad, what I drink. Badman. <laughs> bad I don't like beer. So you know what's Badman, right? Yeah, of so course. So you went to the Chinese guys and they're like, one Badman is gonna stand. Yeah, yeah, like gonna ten Badman. Yeah. I'll buy for everybody. <laughs> so they're gonna be like, uh, also there's a Badman and there is the floss. You can say one floss. What's floss? You one taught me something new. Same Badman. They're gonna give you a little floss. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I took a little rest. And I'm here, Dangriga, famously known as the center, the heartbeat of culture here in Belize. Got about an hour until the sun goes down, so I will walk and talk. And when the sun goes down, I, I heard the drums might come out. People come out and party on a Friday night. So let's see what kind of adventure I can have. And I'm hungry. But the adventure begins now. Where am I? <laughs> You're in Dangriga. Okay, what should I say? I just got out of my taxi right this moment. This is the beach. The whole beach is there. This is the main, the downtown. Okay. What do you want to say? I want to start with something good and local to eat. What do I eat? You could eat podot. What's that? That's plantain with fish. Yeah. Or, or sere with fish. What's a good restaurant? Islands. 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 Yeah. Where is it? On this street? No, right down south. Okay. On the, on the side. All right. The side. Pleasure to meet you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just walking around. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna remember I'm to come good. down this way. <laughs> this is the main. You have to remember yeah. the main, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You can't last this, right? <laughs> I appreciate you. Thank you, sir. He walked up to me and said, "You're the documentary guy. Turn on the camera." Yes. yes sir. Hello. Nice to meet you, sir. You too, sir. Huh? Where, where do I find some drums tonight? Drums. After dark, are there drums coming out? Yeah, after dark, the drums are Where? Is this on this street? No, not this street. Where do I go? Far up, like Lakeland. So on this street, just further down? That's correct. What time do you think? Around 6 o'clock. 6? Yeah. Oh, that's only in an hour. Yeah, within an hour. So you see my videos on YouTube? Oh, I saw your interview, everything. I appreciate Good that very much. Sir. And now you're on the next one? Yes. So first thing much. tomorrow, what's your name? Eduardo. Are you from this area? Yes, from this area. What must I see? Let's say I'm here two days. What is the most important factors I need to document? Uh, the most important documents is that you need to walk around the riverside. Yes. See the guys out there, talk to them. What do they do on the riverside? Uh, they're bringing their fish. They have it on sale. Okay. And for the riverside, I just walk down this yes, way? Yes, to the right. Yes. Okay. Anything else that I must, must, must see? Uh, we have a why not island over there. Okay. What happens on the because island? Because I know you're mostly looking for people that are... People to, to talk to. Right. I heard this is a cultural spot to come. Yes, it is. So that's why I'm here. So, I don't know. I get lost in the street and see what happens. Right. So it was a pleasure meeting you, sir. You too, sir. Have a great day. Pretty neat. I only got out of my taxi three, four minutes ago, and three people have already recognized me from my YouTube videos. It's amazing. Very, very, very incredible. The feeling of uh, you know, hard work, hard work pays off. Consistency wins always. You know, if you're thinking about doing a YouTube channel, no matter if it's travel or what it is, just consistently put up good content. Show your personality. You don't have to be as adventurous as me. You don't have to go to hoods. It could, your content could be about anything. Consistency, guys. Consistency. Now I see a horse on the bridge. Let's find out a little bit more. I can smell the fish right now. Hello. 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 Hello.
Show us some tricks. Let's see some tricks. We don't have no tricks. Come on. I know you can stand up on the back two legs. Making the horse dance. So you know the trick. You got to make it stand. My friend, when it gets dark, where do I go to see drumming? Where do I go? This way? Yep. After dark? After dark. Okay. All right. Thank you, sir. That, that's the, um, let me see. It's Friday night. It's Friday night, right? You are from United States. Canada. So, Canada. So, this is a block. Now, tell to a block. This is one block. One block. Every city is a block, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks from here. After dark or right now? After dark. After dark. All right, my friend. Thank you. Eh? Bunch of little shops, clothing shops. I'm in your city. Yeah, you're in my city. You say you won't come again. So what's up? I'm here. You tell okay, me, what should I see? Right now. I have so much things to see. Bro. I've only been here 10 All minutes. Right, so you, you come out of my... 10 minutes? Uh, uh, yeah, you need to go at the back shed. Uh, where's that? The back shed. You know where that you is? Know, is? You know, uh, the next to the 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 farmer's farm uh, city. You said the back shed. What happens there? At night time. All right, I appreciate that. What's the name of your your sh shop here? This is Kush International, bro. Okay. Yeah, like I said, I always watch a show at the end. I appreciate that. Every day. So you're doing a good job, but my only thing is my only thing is I notice on the show. Like I said, I won't knock you or, 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 or say anything bad on that, but I'm going to share with you since you're yeah, here now. for sure. Okay. What I noticed on the show, right, um, like you said, when someone beg you for money, you know, yeah. give them. That's something very, 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 very good, right? But what I noticed, Take that right. whenever you go, Take that right. Take that right. Time for whenever, whenever you go anywhere, and then okay, go down, go down the you meet people and stuff like that, first thing what I'm, that I see, like you offer them drinks. Yes, and that's it's one not one a one bad one thing. Right? Yeah. But yeah. then sometimes you go to the poor neighborhood. I see you yeah. offer yeah. food too, don't get me wrong. Yeah. Yeah. I see you offer food, I think that's a good thing too. But you need to do a little bit. Start off with the food before the drinks. Yeah. Yes. And talk to tell guys that when and they're, you know. You start off with the food before the drinks. Yeah, because then appreciate that. Everybody, you know, like I say, you go into these areas and a lot of poverty is in there. So it's unfair to some uh, people, uh, you're going to offer uh, drinks uh, 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 Because sometimes people won't say, hey, Chris, I need food. Right because yeah. like I said, that's, that, you know, look good. Uh, yeah. So the best thing going to say, okay, you guys, you, okay, you ate already before you said you drink. If you want to drink a bad man or whatever, whatever. Yeah. That's, that's how you deal with it, but that's my little two cents you know, about that. I appreciate it. So you, you could, if you go to a next neighborhood that is, okay, that is go, 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 really, really poor people, yeah. that's okay, the approach you should use, Chris. But yeah, I appreciate so that. So far, man, I like yeah. the show. I appreciate that. Earlier I was watching the show, Chris. Yeah, that's Very good job. You was in Thai. Yeah, and I, and amazing, I like, no? And I like what I saw yesterday. Yeah. I appreciate that. And I, I wanted to Man, comment. I, I still got a lot to learn. I wanted to comment. Yeah. But I didn't comment because then I was, right, like, I was busy. Yeah. So I had to watch the show after I finished from right, shop or whatever. Yeah. So I could tell you when I said, I hope Chris come. Yeah. So right, I could tell you about it. So this is a Punta Town. You're the original Punta Town. I, I better see some Punta yeah, here. You don't oh. see Punta, bro. <laughs> you don't need to continue to ask like when you went to Kikaka. Nobody Kikaka. knows. Yeah. This is a Punta Town. Yeah. Town of the Garifuna. What do you want to know? Like, you could go I definitely want to see some drumming. I want to see some dancing. Well, that's not happening right now. But tonight, once it gets dark? Tonight, um, islands. What's islands? I, I don't really know much about the outing here because I'm not like an... 
But Islands is a restaurant? Yes, it's a bar and grill. Okay. Um, located in uh, the front of Bar Mall. Okay. Yeah, so. That's easy to remember. Yeah. Okay. I'm just wandering around. Right. Getting, getting lost. And I, I just come off of work. Yeah. From the Riverside Bar Ships. I work at Bar Ships. Yeah. My name is Brittany, by the way. Nice to meet you. Yeah. It's an honor. I love it. I'm excited to explore a new town. I, just, I got here like 15 minutes ago. I didn't think ago. that you were going to be here because last night I was watching you answering some questions and then they were like, are you going to come to the Dangria? I thought I would move with a little bit little bit of curiosity. Yeah, but it's so... And to be honest, I woke up this morning and I'm like, I need to go south. Uh -huh. I need to I need to see it. So <laughs> that's what got me here. Uh, but it was an honor. It was yes. an honor meeting you. Uh, I'm not sure, but um, there's a um, Kia's bar yeah. um, that's way on the south side. Yeah. In Lakeland area, um, they usually have drumming, but I'm not too certain if they'll yeah. be hosting any drummings tonight. I'll get lost. Or this evening. I'll get lost and see what happens. So it's an honor. Thank you very good much. Good meeting you, Christmas. It's completely my pleasure. <laughs> Bye. Have a great weekend. So I got Islands um, has been the restaurant recommended to me now, so that's pretty easy to remember. So I'll keep walking and talking and see if I can, first and foremost, I'm hungry, I need to find some food. Secondly then, it's when we celebrate. I just heard in the background, by the police station, isn't that the white man? Yes. Yes. How are you doing, sir? I'm doing wonderful. How are you doing? I am doing great. Nice to meet you. Chris. I'm Nick. I Nick. know Chris. Nice to meet you. I've seen you on YouTube. Yeah. What do you think? I think you need to highlight some of the real beauty of Belize. Well, you know, the reason I'm here uh -huh. is to learn more about the culture so I can show that side. Yeah. My, my motto is that there's, there's great stories with everybody, yeah. rich and poor. And you start with the good. You, start, you don't perpetuate the stereotypes. No. You, you busy right now? I'm walking around. I'm getting lost. Come on, show me something. Show me something. I like that. You see, people have negative or, let's say, distorted right. perspectives of some of the third world countries. Yes. Right? And some people and know nothing. They have no idea. Correct. Yes. Some people are blank slates. Yes. And when, when we, when people... Yes. See your videos, bro. I'm honored. Yeah, you gotta say hello. Yes, <laughs> thank you very much. When people put stuff out there yes. on YouTube or whatever, and it focuses on the negative, then that's what people use to define the place and I'm not saying there's not poverty there's not crime there's yep. not all these things which are part of every society every community every town in the world in the world yes but that does not define it may or may not define the see, towns I'll tell you what my perspective is 100% mm -hmm. I see you eye to eye 100% mm -hmm. right a lot of people think it's my responsibility to show both I've never been in a country anywhere in the world where a rich man has picked me up off the side of the street and said, come to my house for dinner. If that day ever occurs, I'll go to that person's house for dinner. Well, but for the most part, it's, it's the poorer people that welcome me into their house with well, open arms yeah. and they have stories that they need to release. And to be honest, those people that are dealing with poverty and crime, they could care less about the tourism side of it. They want to be heard. Correct. Their stories need to be heard. Correct. Right? Well. Telling the story, it's not about telling the story because I'm not saying that you're not yes. reporting truth. It's facts. Yes. Right? It's how the story is told and what is the lasting impression. Hey, hey. What's the lasting impression on the viewer's mind? Yes. And and the thing that we don't want to do is perpetuate stereotypes. So can I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to surprise you now. Mm -hmm. I would say based on, let's say a million people have watched my videos from mm -hmm. Belize, mm -hmm. more people want to come to Belize than there, there's no negativity. Okay. See, I think you as being a local, you think I'm about not it. A local. Uh, well, you're I'm, here. I'm you're, an outsider just like you. Okay, but you're physically here. Yeah. You're locally here. Well, so um, are you. Because, yeah, a lot of the feedback I've gotten 
is like, wow, Belize was never on my list. I didn't even know it was a country. Yeah. I found the content, and and I know I'm not going to please everyone. Well, but I, I, I get it 100. percent Okay, so so let me tell you, uh, give you something anecdotal. Yes. Um, and I do appreciate the feedback, by the way. Hey, man, and I'm happy to share this yes. with you. And I'm not saying you're a bad guy yeah, yeah. or any of that. I'm gonna let this guy go by. All right. Um, I'm just saying, do the 360. Yeah. Because well, that's why that's why I'm here as yeah. a, a starting point. And 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 to say that, um, I, I wanted to show you this, which I think is so cool and amusing, but. Um, the actors aren't here right now. Maybe just chill for a little bit and talk. You see these blackbirds? Yep. I find it so funny. The camera won't see it. It's too far, but we I can, see we it. We can yeah. get out and go and have yeah. a look. Yeah. But here's, here's my story on that, because I want to shoot it. Yeah. It's so hot in Belize today, even the birds are at the beach taking a swim. Yeah. Because they're, right they're right on the water's edge and they're swimming. They're, you know, getting, yeah. taking baths. And I think that's funny. I think, I think that is more of what I see in Belize, the uniqueness, um, the environment, the animals, the beauty. But the, the sad story and the reality is, mm -hmm. if I did a video about birds at a beach, nobody would watch it. That's not true. Test, That's not let's true. test the theory. That's not true. If, if, you took, if you took a picture of birds going to the beach for a swim, yeah. people would watch that. No. Yeah. Different type of people. Of course, but people nonetheless, it's a different I know, audience. But it, and that's my point. Yeah. That's my point. <laughs> We're going to debate back and forth. No, my point is... Jack it out. You're saying you're cold. Woo! I'm not cold, but... Yeah. Your wind affects my lungs. Yes, I got you. That was perfect timing. For me. So normally on a Friday night, what happens? Parties? Parties, yeah. What else? Oh, you're hard to talk right now. You're breathing. Yeah. yeah. So that's where we just were, the island breeze. No crocodiles? Yeah, we do. Yeah? Friendly you, ones. You ever wrestle a crocodile? Nah, man, never. I never imagined that. <laughs> it's become an inside joke for me. Yeah. To wrestle a crocodile. So you've seen a crocodile here? Oh, yeah. More than once. And the kids swim here? Yeah. But no problem. The difference about it is that the crocodiles go down by the market and they feed them. Okay. So the kids doesn't have to worry about it. Gotcha. You know. No danger. I've been, yeah, I've been here for years and never here with a crack attack. Yeah. So explain to me, you were telling me in the restaurant, but explain to me uh, a little bit why this is the cultural center of Belize. Well... The Angriga is the place, the biggest area. You know what? It's so windy. Can we move over just a little bit? I'm just worried that it's not going to sound yeah. as good as it should. But I want it to sound good. I want it to sound good. I'll be big on YouTube. Yeah, you're a star. I can tell already. Let me start off by saying I just met Charlie. Yeah. Uh, and he started sharing a little knowledge with me. And I love knowledge. So, Charlie, talk to me. Where are we? Well, you're in the heart of downtown Dangriga. Okay. Well, you know, you're on the south side of the bridge, which is, this is like the center of town, so to speak. And it's a Friday night, there's people out and about? Yeah, Friday night, you know, people's out, hanging out, some, somewhere at a bar or somewhere playing music somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. So why do they consider this the cultural center for Belize? Because um, this is where the black indigenous group of people call themselves Garifuna. This is the main hometown. This is the biggest area okay. you would find Garifuna people living. Right. There's more Garifuna in Honduras 
But the Anguiga is the biggest settlement yeah. for the Garifuna people. <laughs> yeah, and you said it's everything from music? Yeah. Everything from music? Yeah, everything to the, from music. the fashion? Yeah, put the rock music, yeah. Russian, everything. I mean, this is where the Punta rock music is yeah. originated from. So the dance in the Punta? Yes, sir. Yes. Well, that's why I'm here. I came here to learn about the drums, well, the culture, and the dancing. Well, hang with me. Hang with you? You're the tomorrow, guy? Yeah, yeah. You're going you're gonna to show me tomorrow? Well, yeah, you're going to see how they, how they play the music. And if, it, if, I had, if I know if they have anything like, see, they have a, they have a thing here they call them. Um, Beluria. Beluria is like, uh, let me give you what Beluria is like. Beluria is like somebody died and they have a funeral service. And for eight days they will have one, one, one hour of prayer meeting. Huh? And on the ninth night, they try to make it be on a fire Saturday. Yeah. But when everybody goes there, then you will have live music, you will have people throwing dice, gambling, people telling folk stories, right, right. food are issuing out. Right. It's a small, like small village life here. Yeah, this is this is what you would call celebrating the life of someone that have to, has passed away. Yes. You call that ninth night or in Garifuna we call it Beluria. So Garifuna is a language as well? Yes. So what is the language? Like how how do I say hello? Well better yet, if I was to ask you how you doing, I would ask you Ida Biyangi. Okay, Ida Biyangi. Right, how are you doing? Now the dialect, where does it come from? Well, it's a, it's a combination of black, African, and Yarrow in there. Okay. And that language comes in. And from a skin complexion, it is black people. Black people, yeah. Only. Black people. Yes. Black people. A lot of people, a lot of people on YouTube told me I have to come here specifically to learn more about the culture right. and the Garfunda right. culture. Right. So I'm here. Right. Uh, and you consider yourself a Garfunda? I'm 100% Garfunda. You're, my first, the you're the word, first one that I've ever met. The word is Garifuna. Garifuna. Right. Garifuna. I'm straight out of, I'm straight out of Dangri. I'm 100% Garifuna. Yeah. My mom was a Garifuna. My daddy's a Garifuna. You were born here? I was born here. Wow. Wow. But the age of 18, I left from here. Yeah. And I went to New York City. Yeah. You know, I did, I did 13 years out there. Camera, yeah. Camera, yeah. Why are you a camera people for? Why? 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 Who will I do I mean, I ask a question. No, I, I have no problem answering the question. No problem. Yeah. 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 No problem. Drunk. Yeah, as usual. They, they wouldn't do that to me now because yeah. they respect me. Oh, is there, there's alcohol involved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. So it's Friday night. I'm gonna meet up with you tomorrow to learn more about the culture. Definitely. But where do I where do I go now? Where should I? I'm gonna go walk by myself. Where should I go? Just walk, yeah, walk and see what happens. Yeah, yeah, just walk around and get lost. And where's your vehicle? No vehicle. So how are you gonna to get to Davis for? Horseback. <laughs> well, you gonna hunt? No, I'm gonna find a taxi on the way. But I'll walk a bit. Okay. So I'm gonna call you. Call. Give me a call tomorrow. Yes. And I'll be right here. And I'll find you there. Yeah. My friend, it's been a pleasure. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All, All right. the best. Oh. Do you have Red Bull? Huh? Red Bull? Yeah. Need a little pick-me-up. I'm tired. Oh my. You have change for 50. Okay. I don't have anything small. Thank you. Here, Thank you. you have a garbage? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Hello. Hey, hello. Hey, hello. Hey, hello. Hey, hello. So in the morning. Yeah, I can see. 
is it? Yeah. It's a must. It's a must. And look, my friend Charlie's back. Yeah. Uh, this is me. Yeah. No, you didn't give me change. Okay, I got five bills for you. So I was just walking down the street with my good friend Charlie and this whole family here. I don't know, family and friends. We're so incredible and generous and kind. So at least I gotta say hello, everybody. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Karen. Karen. Happy Karen. Yes. Money. 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 Morning. 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 Like money. Like the money you spend. Money. The money yeah, money. Away. I'm still learning the language. So he's gonna bring me out fishing. Yeah. Tomorrow, and then we'll do some kind of catch and cook type thing. And, and you're gonna cook? Psh, dreads gonna cook. How come all the dreads are the best at cooking? It's in you, huh? All the best food I ever had. Dreads. Say hello. Don't be so shy. Nah, don't be shy. We, we got future YouTubers, hopefully. Hopefully? Yeah. So you guys are all from this area, yeah, this community. Yeah. So tell me, I'm only here for two or three days. What is mandatory? What do I have to see? Our culture. Yeah, but what is dances, it? Tell me more. Dancing drums. with the drums. Okay. The Garifuna drums. Dance yes. Keys. And the dancing is famous here. Because when I ask people in other communities, they say, you got to come here mm -hmm. to see the proper dancing. Yep. Yes? All right. Guys, thank you very much. Yeah, it was yeah, an honor. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. you guys are too kind. I'll see yeah. you again. Okay, then take care. Bye. Yes, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yes. 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 Tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning. Bye, Chris. Bye bye. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you. Bye bye. And tomorrow you're going to see my video. I'm going to be doing the Punta dance with Charlie. No, not with Charlie. Not with Charlie. But I'll be doing it. <laughs> bye bye. I find from doing it now, so yeah. they will probably do that too. Tell me, Charlie. Let what? me tell you, see how incredible people are? Yeah. All over the world. Well, yeah, you, Man, let you me... Got good, you've got good people, bad people. No, we're world. not talking about bad people. We're talking about good people. Yeah. Because I don't know how to explain it in words. I'm not that good with words to explain how good and, and heartwarming it feels when strangers come up and they appreciate Thank it. Thank you. That's Man, right. like... I'm the most down-to-earth, humble man in the world, and it's appreciated. It is genuinely appreciated. So we're gonna have a good time. Hello. Hi, boyfriend. How are you? <laughs> boyfriend. Oh, you're my girlfriend now. My wife is gonna kill me if she finds out. <laughs> Who's that? Your friend? Man, what a beautiful night. See that happiness just makes the night so much more incredible. When I woke up this morning, I started my video by saying, "Today is gonna be a wonderful day." It sure is. And what happened? It's Working a one. It's a wonderful day, my friend. Thank you for showing me around as well. It's funny, we actually said goodbye, then I met that family, and then... No, this is my then, 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 then Charlie came back. Yeah, yeah, I see you there. Said, why not? Let's go. Let's go listen to some drums. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes. See, Chris. They call me Chris or Badman? Because I drink the Badman. No crocodiles? Uh, you're not going to see them, no. You don't see it. So where are we heading? We're going to the shed. The shed? Where they have the drumming. Okay. So we're heading to the shed. Where they have the drummings. What about you? Do you know how to play the drums? No, nah, man. No? All I do is advertise it. But you dance? I dance. Okay. But I advertise the drum more. Yeah. Because I'm more like, a, as I said, I'm the local guy here, so. Yeah. When I meet people, they. You show them around. You show them around the drum. I had a cousin, but well, now he moves to Los Angeles. Yeah. He has his own band in LA. Yes. But he plays good drums. Yeah. yeah. I've never been uh, into like playing live music, but I appreciate it when people can do it. Yeah. You know, I never played any instruments or yeah. drums or anything like that. But when I watch them play with passion, it gets my heart. Yo. My heart jumping around. You got some good ass drummers around. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so do you willing for me to direct you? Well, he's directing me, but if you have something. a recommendation, what about the, where are we going to go? The shed. Right? The shed. Yeah, the, the shed, shed is good? This way, you know, yeah. at Harlem. Yes. You know, beautiful. Okay. This is the beautiful, you know. Well, I appreciate you, Summer. Yeah. Your friend's I'm here, you know, I'm just, I'm She's a little younger, just struggling. Yeah. You know, just like everyone else. Yeah. 
you know, but we have a smile. I'm happy for everyone out there who is doing their best, who yes. is uplifting yourself as a ghetto youth. You know, I just want to see all ghetto youth rise and have something in life. You know, so I want everyone to have a blessed night. Yes. And God is also with you and have a holy heart towards everyone. Mm -hmm. I want it. I want. I just want to say. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to the um, gotta protect the poor. You know, yes. God is good. No, God is great. And you looked uh, up God at the sky. In many ways. And you looked up at the sky. You know, yeah, I looked at the sky too so, to to tell them this Thank is you. real. Yes. You know, one day the world will come to an end. I just want to say that. Yes. You know, God love everyone who do good, who is doing good, continue to go do who is doing bad. Just try to stop and put the good over evil. I bye love bye. it. I appreciate that. Thanks, ladies. Thank you. Bye bye. Summer want to go viral. Yeah. What do you think? Summer is going to go viral? Well. <laughs> she had a very positive message. So the message is, is something that I'm hearing. It's a recurring theme over and over again, like positivity, religion, mm -hmm. God, mm -hmm. uh, you know, appreciative as to appreciative as to what she has, the, what she said, the little she has. Incredible people here in Belize. Yeah. This is a reason, if not for anything else, you, you guys make a trip to Belize because if not, you're missing out. Good missing time. out on the people, the culture. Yeah. So where are we going? Further down. What's this little bar? It's a whorehouse. Oh, that's a whorehouse. How beautiful a message. <laughs> our goal. goal. What is our goal, Charlie? Tell Music. me. Music. Music? So hopefully there's live band, live drumming? Yeah, drumming, yeah. Wow, that'd be incredible. I didn't bring a flash, guys, so you have to you have to deal with the low light situation, but hopefully the audio is enough to keep you to keep you here watching the video. It's my first night here. I'll be back all day tomorrow and possibly the next day I'm gonna go to Hopkins as well. So if you guys wanna see content from this part of Belize you got a good two three four videos coming uh, so stay tuned I don't agree with and, 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 and I'm excited to share with you guys some different type of content as well uh, I don't like only shooting gangs uh, I want to show culture I want to show the good people here of Belize and I hear music now but it sounds like music so as we get closer I'm gonna turn off the camera until the drum playing happens because I can't play copywritten music or, or they block me in countries all over the world, so turn this camera on very soon. I'm telling Charlie, I'm 44 years old, and I never died once in my life. Well, not of us, not yet. No, no, but hear me out. I've been to all these countries around the world. Right. And, and I survived. never died once. Yeah, yeah, you survived. Yes, yeah. So when you say you're worried about me, that, yeah, 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 yeah. never. All right, all right. I'll hitchhike. He's like, There's, the taxis are not going to be out. I said, don't worry, I'll hitchhike. He's like, no, he's a protective man. He's like, no, I'm going to take care of you. I told him I never died once. Yeah, 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 yeah. I understand all And I want your jacket, but you're just too small. Your jacket, it, I won't, even, give it, to it you. won't even fit my right leg. That's what I said. My leg is bigger than your, your back. I could get you one. Yeah. There's a store that we can go and you can get one. Yeah. But here? It's going to be Belize City or Belmont Man, Belize City and Belmont is so far. 
muy lejos. No, no. We can go to Pelican tomorrow. What's Pelican? It's a big resort about... Man, ten, I like that jacket. Ten minutes away from here. Okay, and they got that jacket? I'll find you Let me see that. Oh, I like this. This um. Man, I'm, I'm, what I'm saying is if, I, if I'm in Belize and I'm wearing a Belize jacket... Yeah, you're gonna kill it. Man, people are gonna love me more. Yeah, local. Exactly. And it looks good. I like those colors. Yeah, they're gonna, call, they're gonna consider you the local. Yeah, they're gonna call me local. Local? Lo local vocal. No, not, not local. Local, like crazy, man. No, man. Local. Yeah, they're gonna call me the crazy man. <laughs> Tell me. Huh? <laughs> no, See what I'm saying about me and Charlie? We met each other three hours ago over dinner. My I'm brother. Now, my now, brother. He's a brother from for another mother. For life. He's a brother from another mother. My friend, tell, 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 tell the world how we got to end racism. Tell the world. Man. You, you, wait a sec. Uh, I'm going to ask you a question. Uh -huh, you look at me different because I'm white? No. Do you think I look at you different because you're black? No, I don't think so. I no. don't I don't feel that way. No, we're brothers. Exactly. We're the same. Exactly. You know, through viewership, people can understand that around the world, doesn't matter your religion, your color, color your race, creed. we're brothers. Yeah, we're brothers. We're brothers. We're brothers. Never because question that with me. All the heart, white, black, green, yellow, all your heart pump is red blood. You ever see a white man? Pumping blue blood or green blood, or you see an Indian pumping yellow blood? No. Yeah. Black, white, red Man, blood. You know what's crazy with this channel? I want more than views. I want to change the, the world. I want to end racism one person at a time. And I'm going to share with you guys a story. I'm going to share a story with you okay. that I learned here in Belize. Somebody told me this on the island, and I think it's actually very important. So I'm going to share it with you. Okay. So it was talking about a tourist family and the child. They woke up early to see the, the water rise right. and drop right. from the sea. Low tide and high tide. So the child, what they saw is all these starfish on the, on the beach. Mm -hmm. Thousands of them. Right. So the child is new to this. So they're like, no, we got to save the starfish. Right. So they start running and grabbing the starfish and throwing, back and in the throwing in them the back in the water. Mm -hmm. But there's thousands of them, right? So any normal human being would be like, no. No, we can't do that. We can't save every one of them. So as this child is running and throwing them in the ocean, the starfish, to save their life, the mom comes out and be like, ha, huh, Johnny, you will never save all of them. Come inside, let's have breakfast. And Johnny said, no, I'm not trying to save everyone. I'm trying to save one at a time. So I'm not trying to end racism with this Great video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not trying to end it. It's impossible. Right, it's right. an impossible task. But what I'm saying is, me and him, we're brothers. Yeah, we try black and white, it doesn't matter. We don't talk about it. Yeah, 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 when yeah, I met yeah. you, I didn't say, hey, I'm meeting a black man. Yeah, yeah, right, 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 right. We meet a brother. What? Man, we're brothers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I'm saying is, one by one, if you live in a, uh, a white community and you've never been around a black person before, invite them to dinner. Right? Befriend them. Same thing, if you're in a black community, you don't know a white person, I, what? But I think that's very difficult for people. No, we're changing that, Charlie. Well, I, w I would like to. We're using the platform for yes. a positive I reason. Like no, I we are like making it. it happen. I would like it. You know, we what do you, we're, we're making it happen. We're all human. Mm -hmm. Right, we're one person, human. Exactly. Right? Exactly. Forget everything else. And in my lifetime, if we can help a few starfish, not everyone, if we can help a few starfish, we've done our job. Charlie, we gotta go back and dance. Because you know what everybody said? Mm -hmm. They said they're not leaving until they see you dance. Well, nah, they nah, nah. They, they have, have a problem. Nah, me <laughs> can Nah, Charlie's ready. He is ready. Oh, jacket off. He's getting ready for the dance. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
just put up a uh, YouTube, right? What do you have to say? And I like your video. I like it. But, but what? But, you didn't do everything, all right? No, I'm here now, the show. Yeah, you no, know, you did that. Dang, we got. Show the, I didn't watch it. I watch, I watch, I watch you the, um, Baka Gungulung. But now I'm here. What, 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 you what do I have to see now that I'm here? What you have to see? Yeah. The culture? Man, I'm here for the culture. The I love culture. it. The culture. Tomorrow, what you doing tomorrow? I'm here. Huh? I'm here to learn the culture. What you doing tomorrow? I'm here to learn the culture tomorrow. Okay. Tomorrow I'm going to be walking the streets right here. You said you love fishing. Yeah. I want to carry you on the beach edge and show you a little bit of... How do you fish? With, how, a, with how, a net? How, how, with net. Yeah. And I was, I was hand line. We do hand line. We don't got rod and reel. We use hand line, right? Let's do it. But you are Chris, 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 Chris Muscles. Yes. What's your? That's it, yeah. Okay, I'm My following you. I'm yeah. following you. I appreciate that. Right on YouTube. I'm yeah. following you right now. You can't get another video, bro. I can hear you. You can't. I hear you. I hear you. You're not going to get no rhyme. I will. I will. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Adventure of traveling. Sing. <laughs> 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 